My major is French, so I definitely like languages, and computer science is sort of like another language to me. Translating from English to the um, programming language is fascinating. We study the way that robots work, uh, specifically how to program robots to interact with their environment. We also look at representations of robots in popular culture. Robots are really interesting, and, and people really like programming with robots. And as a result of that, it seemed like a, a great opportunity to use uh, the robots as the vehicle by which we can teach programming concepts, critical thinking, and algorithmic thinking. How do I solve a problem with a series of steps? We'll pull out the robots and we'll hard code them to do different things. Say follow a maze on the ground, do a little dance, something like that. Then we'll learn something slightly more advanced in programming, uh, using loops within your programming. And then we'll just keep advancing slightly more advanced coding and then show how that applies to the robots to solve different and more challenging problems. I think of it as like a puzzle or a game. So you're given uh, this amount of information and this goal and you kind of have to fit the pieces together to achieve that goal. You spend a few hours working and just repeatedly failing over and over and over, making minor corrections, getting a little bit closer to the problem and a little bit closer, and it finally works. You know, after four to six hours in the lab and you finally have stumbled upon this, you know, the secret, so to speak, it's really, it's really pretty exhilarating to finally get it. We really want to get across what is computer science about? Too often people think it's just about programming or about sitting in this, in, this, you know, in this cubby and never talking to anybody else. And so part of what we're trying to do here is to dispel some of that with something that, that's really interesting and, and fun. It gave me more of an appreciation for uh, the complexity of computer science. And even just the amount of society that's based around computers today, it lets you see just how much time and effort goes into the programming and the development of these models. 